and Tima from Cypress Paradise. Welcome to Cypress Paradise. Welcome to Paradise Live. Today I'm at the Orchid Festival in Kyrenia, one of the finest festivals of the year. It's a traditional festival with uh, a lot of displays of heritage, culture, tradition, and there are organized walks as well to the orchid area, and you can discover the flora, fauna, see the unspoilt nature of Cyprus. As you can see behind me, we have some traditional dancers. <laughs> and if you'd like to come with me, we can have a look at some of the organic stalls and traditional stalls um, that they have at this festival. And I can um, explain to you exactly what, what the things are that they're selling here and how traditional they are to Cyprus. And uh, we will also meet someone who organises the festival and learn just a little bit more about the tradition of this exciting festival. So stay with me, share now with your friends who'd be interested in learning some culture and heritage and tradition about North Cyprus. And anyone who would like to join this festival, it does continue tomorrow. So if you are staying in Kyrenia at the moment, then um, please do come along tomorrow. It goes on till 11 p.m. tomorrow. So share with your friends now, anyone who's here at the moment, um, who you think would like to pop along. Just share with them now and come with me and I'll show you a bit more. So these are some of the things that they sell in Cyprus. Some of the traditional snacks. Cheese pastry, cheese pastry. Really delicious. The opening ceremony is in Spanish. And um, everyone can ride the rails around the many stalls which are selling these organic products and many other items. There are also folk dancing displays and other traditional shows. And a festive fire will be lit later, which adds a lovely atmosphere to the occasion. As you can see, everybody is really happy, everyone's in a good mood, all the locals get together. There's some traditional breads over there. Some traditional sweets over here. Thank you. This is Lokma, a traditional sweet, and it's really delicious. It's kind of like a syrupy donut. Thank you. Some handmade things over here. <laughs> Lots of handmade jewellery, craft bracelets, gorgeous photo frames, pictures with orchids. Have a look at this. These are all handmade. Really gorgeous. Hi. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thanks again for tuning into Paradise Live. We're actually in um, the finest festival of the year at the moment, the Orchid Festival. Just walking through the stalls and having a look at some traditional items that you can buy at the festival. Really, really beautiful things that they make here in Cyprus traditional to Cyprus, traditional to the culture and heritage of Cyprus, beautifully handmade items. Really artistically made. Look at this one's gorgeous. How much is this? <laughs> So that works out about ten pounds, just over ten ten pounds, about twelve pounds fifty. Absolute bargain. The real stones. These 
the traditional handkerchiefs and scarves and they dance with these as well, Turkish dancers. They have festivals um, throughout the year like this in Cyprus and it's really nice to come along and take part in witnessing the tradition and culture of North Cyprus. This is the famous eye. It keeps the bad eye away, it keeps, keeps the evil away. It's a tradition in North Cyprus. Everybody has one of these. You can only give it as a gift to somebody and um, you can't buy it yourself. It actually keeps the evil eye away from you. That's the belief here in North Cyprus. And there's some more Turkish foods over here. Lots of atmosphere. Another beautiful jewellery shop. Thank you. We've got really nice jewellery here. Yeah. Actually, they are most of them are handmade. Really? Who makes yeah. them? Uh, my mother, she's sitting there. Hi. Hi. Wow, you're really talented. Thank you. Lovely jewellery. Do you come to this festival every year? Uh, I think it was the beginning was the last year, and it's it's been two years that we're attending. Really nice things. Thank you so much. Thank you. Come enjoy yourself. And some more Turkish sweets over here. I've just seen one of the organizers. Her name is Dervisha. So we're going to go and have a word with her right now. And she can um, give us a little more explanation about this festival and what it means. Hi, Hi hello. How are you? I'm fine, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. Welcome, by the way. Thank you. Can you tell us about this festival, please, and what it means? Yeah, it's uh, its its seventh year, yeah. and uh, we do this festival uh, for the... So the observation of the wild orchids that grow on our farm uh, island, yeah. uh, and actually uh, the spotted yellow orchid, uh, it only grows on this part of the island. There is actually a statue. Yeah. Uh, so we uh, have stands, uh, and there are uh, organic food, uh, it's like a traditional item. Uh, you can buy everything. Uh, below the society. And I went on one of the walks earlier actually and we spotted a yellow orchid and um, also a purple orchid which is really quite rare in Cyprus to spot. Yeah, there's only eight uh, kinds of orchids in Cyprus and one of it only grows in this park. Wow, that's amazing. So anyone who's a nature lover, botanics and um, flower lovers would love to come and discover the wild orchids and flora. Um, around this area in North Cyprus. It's really, really beautiful. You can really get an insight into how the natural beauty of North Cyprus really is when you pop along to one of these events. Should we go and look at some more stalls now? Thank you so much. Thank you. It's lovely to meet you. You too. So there's some organic honey over here that they make in the country and they're selling it here.
And some more traditional breads over here. They have areas to watch dance shows. They have areas where people can sit down, have a drink, get together and um, just enjoy the day. They have the organised walks as well, which take place from 10 to 12 in the mornings. And um, you can walk along and discover the orchids and natural flowers. And they're guided and organised walks. And you can really, really enjoy the natural beauty of Cyprus and take loads of pictures with panoramic views, stunning arrays of flowers and beautiful mountains. Um, it really is gorgeous to enjoy the day here. So for those of you who've, um, who are not going to be around and you've just missed this um, orchid festival, there is a mushroom festival coming up soon. I think that's next week. And there's also a tulip festival, which is going to take place in a couple of weeks' time. So you could always pop along to those. And as I say, the festivals have just started in all the areas of Kyrenia and North Cyprus. And they are really, really a lovely place to get together and enjoy the tradition and culture and heritage of North Cyprus. So if you are on holiday and you're coming soon, then um, by all means you can contact us and you can ask us and we can give you the information of where these festivals are going to take place. And it's really nice to come along and enjoy mixing with the locals and buying some traditional items. So thanks for tuning in to Paradise Live. And I'm going to love you and leave you now and hope to see you next time at another enjoyable festival. And um, look forward to seeing you all this year. Please like and share with your friends now. And um, see you next time. Bye.